That's how it should look. These are all my other designs. You can find out how to fold them and dye them right on YouTube under damn dyes. Have fun. Okay, I'm going to show you how to tie dye a Superman. Yeah. Soak the shirt in the solution you're supposed to with a comes with a tie dye manufacturer. Then you'll need a, a waspel marker. Fold the shirt in half. Using around the chest area. Draw out your Superman emblem there. And then you just follow it. Do a little fan fold. Just follow this line. You make that line straight. Go around the corner. Still keeping this line straight. Some of this you'll have to draw on. Because the S is very tough to do for me anyways. I have not learned to learned that yet. Go around the corner, keeping that line straight. Little fan folds. I'll be making this side yellow and this side blue. And then I'll take some uh, fabric markers and draw the S in there to make the full Superman. And I'll show you that later after I have it dyed. There is uh, one band of red around it. So, I may just do that. I'm going to do that with a red rubber band. Get that nice and tight there. Flatten that out. Now I can stick a couple lower bands here these don't have to be so tight if they're not drawing the full image and then we'll put another red rubber band a little close to this one we'll leave a little space of white there Now this will be red and this will be yellow and the rest will be blue. That's how you fold up the Superman. Okay, this is Superman. We're going to do this part later. This part's red. And then we'll do the outside with blue. You definitely want to make sure this part here is kind of saturated all the way through because it's the red ribbon around the emblem. And actually we can do that with yellow because the inside the emblem is yellow. So do that right now. And then we use dark blues out here. And 
This is a navy blue. Roll it over. And that's how you dye the Superman. Before I do this outside, I'm going to get my house all messy. Okay, I'm back inside. I got some red dye paintbrush. And I drew out the S already for Superman. And uh, it, the shirt's a little damp, so you got to stay away from the, the lines you make because it's going to kind of melt into that area right there. And you just paint the S. You can also, uh, the emblem actually has a little bit of black around the around the S and all that. You can do that if you want. Otherwise you just paint it. I'm just going to show you one side. I got to do the other side too. But don't want to make the video too long. And you actually see what, get the concept of what what you're doing, anyways. It's not going to turn out the same way every time. It's a tie dye. You just can't do it. No shirt looks the exact same. And I do think I am going to do the black outline, but I'll do that off camera. Got to let it dry a little bit. And don't want to make the videos too long. I had a problem with some uh, another S that I was trying to do and I still can't get it. You know, using bleach and I don't want to use bleach. So I'm trying a different different approach on doing that one. Feel free to modify anything that you, that you see that I do anyways. And that's the Superman. That's how it should look. These are all my other designs. You can find out how to fold them and dye them right on YouTube under Damn Dyes. Have fun.